What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. You guys are new to my channel, and you and uh, you enjoy my content. You can smash the sub button and get about the readings. This free general collective reading has to decide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. These are psychic intuitive messages, so it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. I received a couple channelings, but I'm going to do separate readings on both of them because I feel they're separate. So um, I'm going to do this reading on this first channeling and see if I get anything else, and then we'll go from there, okay? I've been getting a lot of reader messages recently, a lot. Some positive, some negative. Um, I don't know who the crap this reader is. Hopefully, we'll find out who she is, but um, this one isn't a, a positive one. I'll just tell you that right now. So, um, just saying. Um, love you guys. Uh, we're at 13,070 subscribers right now. So, thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. I do. Just want to let y'all know. If you think anyone else would like my channel or etc., 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 please feel free to share my channel very publicly, word of mouth, and social media. I very much appreciate it. Okay. So, we're going to just jump into it. Okay. So, um, this channeling, I heard a popular online um, reader, um, tarot reader. I heard Libran Energy, female, female Libran Energy. And why I pull in so much negative female Libran Energy, I have no damn idea. I don't know. Why? I mean, I just don't freaking know. Just saying, just saying. Wh what the hell, man? Let's love all the signs. Just saying. But. Why I pull in such negative Libra and energy, I have no damn idea. I don't come on here and say I hate Libras. I have Libra in my damn chart. So I don't know. I just want a disclaimer that. A popular online Libra reader, I heard, um, has told a lot of her collective uh, slant. Uh, okay. I heard she told a lot of her collective lies about a Leo feminine reader, slandered her name, defamation of character. It is about to seriously affect her business in a very negative way. Um, her clients are about to get a huge ass wake up call. Huge. That's what I heard, man. I don't know, man. I don't. Every communication, I, I mean, why are you gossiping? Okay. I just want to disclaimer this. I have a pretty popular online social media presence too. I mean, hell, I don't have no 50,000 subscribers or anything, but I mean, 13 isn't bad and we're growing. Hell, we grew, we've grown about 20 today. Um, just saying, just saying. So, I mean, I don't have no 2,000 is what I'm saying, you know. It's, I built it over the course of two and a half years. Very, a lot of hard work. I built this thing. A lot. Um, but through all those two and a half years, have I ever gossiped to any of my subscribers about any other um, readers in a negative way that wasn't the truth? I heard it was slander and defamation of character. So whatever she was saying to about this Leo reader wasn't true, is what I'm trying to say. If I've said something to my subscribers about another reader, it's true. And I really stay, stay away from that shit. I stay away from that shit because that's their business. That's their livelihood. That's their thing. I don't go on here. I don't ever try to intentionally, I don't ever slander or defame anybody's character, one. And two, if I say something to my clients and they contact me and we speak about another um, another reader or psychic or spiritualist or et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, it's the truth. It's not lies. Like, I heard slander and defamation of character, so it was lies, is what I'm saying. That's crazy. That's crazy. Why would you do that? I mean, that doesn't make any sense. It doesn't really make any sense. Unless this reader, Libra reader, wanted to intentionally stray her clients away from the Leo reader. I don't know, but the thing is, is, okay. We're all readers on here, man. It's like Walmart. It's like Kmart. It's like Sears. It's like Kroger's and Walmart and Publix. There's a lot of us out there. 
why are you talking bad about them? Just do your thing. Be happy. Do your thing. Do what you're doing. Besides defaming the uh, competition's character. Because those people, I think she views, this Libra and Feminine reader views this Leo Fem reader as competition. Or she did. However, that resonates. That's sad, is what I'm saying. That's really sad. Whoever she is, I didn't hear her name. I didn't hear specifics on her. Maybe we will find it in here. Um, but however that resonates, um, I'm going to pull a couple of tariffs. But however that resonates, she shouldn't have done it. I heard her business is about to go down in um, a huge way. Her clients are about to get a huge wake up call. So she has Libra in her chart. Uh, she could have Libra in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or day, we have her Jupiter charts. It's a Libra, fem Libra feminine reader. Quit gossiping and bitch about other people. Just focus on your own money and your own shit, man. That's really not that hard. Oh my God. Whoa. Oh my God. King of Wands. Sunflowers are very significant to someone. And roses. Okay, I heard sunflowers, uh, sunflowers and roses are very significant to someone. They might be significant to this Libran, gossipy, slanderous Libran person, Libran female reader, or to somebody else. I hope that resonates. Don't shoot the messenger, man. I'm just the messenger from the spiritual universe. And this Libran reader, I, I'm assuming she probably watches my channel or some of her clients do. There's a reason I'm pulling her in so strong. I was in there chatting with somebody from California, and then I get this channel. And that's just the damn truth. Spirit messages you have to like this. The Hermit. These are beautiful cards. I heard sunflowers and roses are significant for someone. Wow, they are flying out. I heard take one. Page of Pentacles. Okay, so we have King of Wands upright, the Hermit upright, Page of Pentacles upright. For one of these Libran readers, they were paid in the past. They were paid in the past to say specific things on their platform. For one of these, Le so it's at least two Libran readers in the universe. At least two that hates this Leo reader. Why the hell do they hate this Leo reader so bad? Um, I have no damn idea. Um, I don't hate any readers out there. I just want to disclaimer that. I don't hate any. Nobody. Nobody. I focus on my own business. My own shit. Um, my clients know that. I know that. Um, that's the way it should be. Um, I heard one of these, Lib so it's at least two Libran female readers out in the universe. One of them I heard was paid in the past to say specific things on their channel. Wow, man. Oh, a lot of money. A lot, a lot, a lot of money. Someone is really looking back on this now. It was a horrible decision. A lot, a lot, a lot of money. Someone is really looking back on this now. It was a horrible decision is what I heard. So it's at least two Libran readers. One was paid a shit ton of money in the past to say specific things on their channel. So basically they, for the love of money, they basically um, just said whatever they uh, were paid to say. And I heard they were paid a shit ton of money to, to do it. Wow, that is selling out if I've ever fucking heard it. 
Oh my God. That's some shit right there. Um, and I heard, I, I'm assuming whoever paid them the shit ton of money to do it in the past, I heard they're really looking back on it now and realized it was a horrible decision. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Someone else is getting a huge wake up call. I heard someone else is getting a huge wake up call. So I don't think it's the person that paid the person, uh, one of these Libran readers, because one got paid in the past a shit ton of money to say, to say whatever they were paid to say. One, it sounds like didn't. But however that resonates, I think the person or people or group that paid this person uh, to basically say a shit ton of money to say whatever they wanted to say, I heard they're um, looking back on it now and regretting it. So they're uh, regretting it. I'm assuming they, and whatever intention they were trying to do, it sounds like it was, it sounds like they were pay. they knew this Libran had a, Libran Femme Reader had a large clientele base. Obviously they, obviously they do, whoever was paid the large amount of money, Libran Reader. Um, you do, you obviously do. They were trying to, I think, and I didn't hear this, it's just my deductive logic reasoning, reasoning, whoever paid you this large ass amount of money, basically, for you to be their little bitch, uh, your public speaking bitch. And I, I mean, I'm just being for real. I'm just calling it how it is. Hashtag real talk here. That's what you were when you accepted all this large ass amount of money to basically be their uh, public speaking bitch. Um, they regret it now, but they were paying you this large amount of money for, for your specific client base. For you to say things to your client base your people on your public platform, whether it's subscribers or what have you, for a reason. They regret it now. So I don't, however that resonates. It could have been a King of Wands that paid you to do this, possibly. Libran, reader. Because they're all about you in here. There's two of you, at least in the universe, that hates a Leo fam and one, and blase, blase, blase. Sunflowers and roses are significant and blase, blase, blase. I think a King of Wands paid you to do it. They had lots of desire, drive, and motivation um, to pay you. But they regret it now. They went in hermit mode now. And they regret it. Page of Pentacles, they're, um, I think they moved on financially from you, obviously. Um, and they're moving on to other business aspects. Business avenues. Wow, man. The shit's about to really hit the fan with one of these businesses in a huge way. The shit's about to really hit the fan with one of these businesses in a huge way. The shit's about to really hit the fan with one of these businesses in a huge way. So, I'm assuming this is the shit hitting the fan. Desire, drive, and motivation. Well, not really. Shit's about to hit the fan with one of these businesses. Wow. Oh, my lord. You plug it in, how it resonates, man. These are beautiful cards. I love them so much. All right, um, let me pull some tea leaf. This is crazy. It's not never a smart idea to down other people's businesses, just to let everybody know. I have a lot of business owners on my um, channel, a lot, a lot of readers. Um, I do I have a lot of readers on my channel. I always have. Um, and that's great. I've seen how they've progressed through my psychic intuitive messages over the years and they have progressed. Most of them have progressed in beautiful ways. Um, and I'm so proud of you guys, the ones that really have come into your own and you're like sunflowers and roses and you blossom ideas. Um, I, I don't think you're these people. Um, I just want to say that. I don't. Um, and a lot of my readers, I know your signs. And you're not these people. I'll tell you that right now. Um, this is, yikes. This is terrible. But I think I have two Libra Femme readers that watches my channel that hates a Leo Femme reader. Whether it's me or another Leo Femme reader. And I'm just being for real because everybody knows I'm a Leo Sun reader. I'm Leo Sun. But I have a lot of Leo readers on here. A lot. So, whoever this Leo Fem reader is, somebody needs to be careful, man. 
Spirit messages you have reflected. Child Protective Services is about to get involved in one of these Libran Feminine Readers live soon. They are about to be pissed. Piss, 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 piss. Some indirectly, some directly. Child protect. Why have I been pulling up so much Child Protective Services energy in here recently? Her Child Protective Services is about to get involved in one of these, uh, well, in the least. It might be both of these readers. Only they know their story, not anybody else. But um, in these readers' lives, one directly and one indirectly, I'm pulling in at least two Libran readers. It might be more. Hell, I might have a whole stalkery plethora of angry, jealous Libran readers watching my channel. For all I know, hell, I don't know. But there's at least two. Um, they they either have children under their care and custody. Or they are connected to someone that has children under their care or custody. Custody. How that resonates, okay? Her child protective services is about to get involved in these Libra and readers' lives soon. Some directly, some indirectly. So some directly meaning I think they actually have custody of child or children, and um, they're about to go, about to come to the Libra and feminine reader um, over issue or issues. For some indirectly, I think it might be a family member. They're about to get involved with uh, like their niece or their nephew or their sister or brother or mother or father or what have you or what have you um or friend or what have you um you plug it in how it resonates spirit messages you have reflected this is so insane in the membrane spirit messages you have reflected December, ladder, broom, ladder, climbing towards success, broom, new home, new attitude. Well, that looks good. December. But we're all about Libran readers attacking Leo reader in here, um, which is really terrible. It's really terrible. But it sounds like um, these Libran readers are about to get heavy negative karma. So, uh, and it sounds like it's about to be from the form of child protective services. Um, some um, directly, some indirectly. December. Some of these Libran readers were part of energy harvesting and a black magic experiment done in the past. It's about to come to the light. They do not want it to come to the light, and it's about to. Oh, my God. Some of these Libran readers were part of a black magic experiment and um, energy harvesting done in the past. So, dark arts. So, whoa. So, they secretly do dark arts. They pose as a light side spiritualist, but really they do dark arts behind the scenes. So much so, they were a part of a dark arts coven, it sounds like, in the past, that performed an experiment, either on a person or family. How that resonate? It has backfired. It's going to continue to backfire. It has backfired. It's going to continue to backfire. There was a conspiracy to try to even it out in the winter time of December of 2021, but it's blown all to hell. Okay, I heard there was a conspiracy theory to even it out in the winter time of December of 2021, but it's blown all to hell. So, Libran readers, I don't know what the hell you're doing behind the scenes, but it's not good, I'll tell you that. Um, you come on here and you portray one thing, but... You do a completely different shit behind the scenes, um, apparently. Whoever you are and how this applies, or at least who are you out in the universe, I feel y'all might watch my channel or somebody you're connected to does. 
It's the reason I'm pulling this in. Her there was, uh, so y'all try to even it out. You done this black magic experiment on person, people, place, family, or situation. Then you try to even it out, even it out in wintertime of uh, 2021. I'm thinking maybe December. There was important conversation or conversations regarding this because we have December. But it's blown out of hell, basically. So um, the plan's blown out of hell. It sounds like already in the universe. Climbing towards success. Know this Leo reader is about to become very successful in many ways. Know this Leo reader is about to become very successful in many ways is what I heard. So you plug it in how it resonates, man. Um, know this Leo reader is about to become very successful in many ways. So I think she's working. <coughs> excuse me. Libran readers, I think she's working on something behind the scenes. Um, she's climbing behind towards success. This is for you, Libran readers, apparently, or somebody connected to you. Maybe I've got some um, minion spies of the Libran readers on here. Hell, I don't know. But however that resonates, just know she's climbing towards success. I think she's about to become successful. She already is successful or is becoming more successful. I think she's working on many ventures, many venues. But obviously, keeping it to herself um, and not publicizing it to the entire world until her work or works are completed or her idea or ideas are completed so people don't steal her shit. You know, like I had to go get my copyright last year because people were stealing my shit on the Secret 7, kind of like that, or something else. You plug it in how it resonates. But she is climbing towards success. Um, it doesn't sound like you want this for her. It doesn't sound like you ever did. To be honest, uh, but you plug it in how it resonates. This is terrible. New home, new attitude. Several shocking series of chain events are about to occur. Her home is about to be revealed to her. For one. One has a home they do not even know exists. Because someone took it from her and they shouldn't have. Okay, here's several shocking series of chain events are about to occur. One of so it's at least two Leo readers in the universe. One of them has a home that doesn't that they don't even know exists. I heard some um she doesn't know it exists because someone took it from her. So someone took her damn home? That's illegal as hell. Maybe you were involved in that shit too, Libra and Reader. Hell, I don't know. Only you know your story, not anybody else. You plug it in, how it resonates, okay? But she has a home, and somebody took it from her ass. They probably were living in it, rent damn free. Like, easy squeezy, lemon peasy, living the fucking life off of somebody else, basically. How sh shitty is that? And that's just the truth. I didn't hear anything else. Through several shocking series of chain events, one of these Libra and feminine readers are about to move. They just cannot afford their home anymore. So, uh, through several shocking series of chain events, one of these Libra and readers are going to um, move soon. They just cannot afford their um, home anymore. So I think they bought a new home. These Libra and readers, I think some of you guys know these Libra and readers. And I'm just being for real. 
There's a reason I'm pulling this in. Uh, I think you know them. I think they have recently bought a new home in the recent past. Uh, maybe in December they bought a new home for some of them. But um, they just can't afford the new home anymore. Um, how that resonates. And to me, it could be a condo. It can be a, a duplex, a single family, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. A townhome, what have you. But they can't afford it anymore if this resonates. Um, and they're about to move soon. So you plug it in how it resonates. We have Libra and Reader energy connected with some Leo fam energy that they just can't freaking stand in here. Uh, you plug it in how it resonates, you guys. All right, I hope this helped, and I'm going to say.